Hey guys, uh, this is me, Peter Elvidge. This is my first live broadcast, uh, so I'm happy to finally be a part of the Periscope community uh, with my Twitter accounts, Facebook, and all those great places. Um, just so you guys are well aware, I won't be able to answer your questions because uh, because of my blindness, I cannot read your comments. However, I have a way of solving this issue. Tweet me out at, at Peter Elvidge. What I will do is after this Periscope, I will get to your questions uh, via my Twitter account. And I think, I think that's how I'm going to do it from now on. Now, um, a little bit about myself is because this is my first broadcast, is that I am an artist despite my blindness. I have two visual um, visual um, factors as to why, why I have blindness. And the first one is uh, glaucoma, which has gone through my family. But also, um, the other is called cone and rod dystrophy, which is the degenerations of your cones and rods uh, type cells in your eyes. Um, just for, just so you guys are well aware, for those of you who are new, I will be answering questions. Tweet me out at, at Peter Elvidge. Uh, I can't answer the questions during the live broadcast because of my visual impairment. But anyways, getting back to it. So, um, if you guys don't know, which, uh, some of you might, some of you might not, uh, I do, uh, I'm, I'm an artist despite my blindness. My channel is Pete4725, as well as you can check out the celebrity videos. I've also got a celebrity artist page as well. Uh, thus you've seen my main Twitter, uh, you know, it's a celebrity artist on it. I work with, uh, Neil Haley of the Total Education Network. And, uh, basically what I'm doing is I'm doing a syndicated network with him, taking his interviews, putting them in the background, and then doing the celebrities and pixel art, which is awesome. So... Um, uh, as you guys can honestly tell, uh, being my first, uh, my first Periscope, I'm a little nervous. I'm not quite sure what to talk about. So I'm just kind of going down the list of learning, you know, telling you guys about me, uh, so that you guys will, f uh, tune in into future broadcasts. Now, what I do hope to do in future broadcasts is show you guys more of my art and what I'm doing currently, what I'm working on that particular day. Um, unfortunately, just cause you know, I want to just get this out there. I want to get used to the flows first, a few first couple of, um, videos might just be me talking to you guys uh just kind of, just to get used to it because i've been doing youtube which is kind of a more uh you know one uh, you know one view type thing versus you know having a live broadcast is something totally different but uh you know i i i love art okay and the thing is is that i have uh my networks are called the hashtag perseverance uh movement or communities or networks because i believe that people can do things you know despite the challenges in their lives and be and the thing is is because so many people in my life have told me you know my teachers um other people in the community so many people say that you can't do you can't be an artist despite your blindness and the thing is is because i have been you know i was vision impaired until 2011 and i was going for graphic design now this is an excessively long story short for you guys but basically, um, after 2011, up until now, I've been gradually decreasing in my vision. And, uh, because of that, I've, you know, gone through some changes as to how I do art. And then obviously I'm not going to be able to go for graphic design. However, I am still doing art despite my blindness. And so many people say that you can't be an artist who is blind. I'm telling you right now, guys, I'm saying it right now. You can be an artist despite your blindness. All right. And the thing is, is that no matter who you are, okay, the, the, there's, there's always someone you know, who has figured out the struggle that you're going through. So I always encourage you guys to like go and search out on YouTube or Google or anything like that, because if, if you've experienced something, chances are someone else has experienced something somewhat close to what you're doing and you, you can overcome it. Okay. And then even if they haven't experienced something that's like exactly like yours, you can, you know, it, given some time and some effort and some self-evaluation, I believe that after, you know, you kind of look at what you're currently struggling with, you can figure out how to get past those barriers. And I'm not going to say it's easy because it's definitely not easy, but it is something I believe that everyone can do. Okay. Um, but for those of you who don't know, and I've, I feel kind of bad because I didn't explain this earlier, is that my, uh, my art form is pixel art. Basically what I do is I create these massive, massive pixel art pieces. Uh, my smallest pieces, well, at least I consider them small, is 150 pixels by 150 pixels for my YouTube channel. Off of YouTube, my pieces can be between 2 and 4 million pixels big. Now, if you can imagine the fantastic, huge quality of 4 million pixels for someone who is blind, can you imagine 
like how many people would freak out and they're like, how can you do it? You know, all this different stuff. I mean, that's what I hope to share with you guys in the future is like, how do I do my, how do I do my art? How do I go about my daily life as a blind artist? How do I, uh, you know, ser- you know, simple things like search on Google or more complex things like how do I make YouTube videos? And the thing is, is that these periscopes are also going to be part of my YouTube channel as well. So if you guys uh, happen to know somebody who missed this uh, periscope, you guys can go and tell them, hey, go and view the channel or there'll be a link on uh, Twitter, I believe. But um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm just, I, I'm having fun with it. I'm looking forward to future streams. I'm planning on doing a uh, a periscope every day, uh, giving an update. And this is going to be Monday through Friday, by the way, I don't quite know about Saturdays and Sundays, Saturdays and Sundays are my weekend. And I kind of like to leave those particularly alone as to, uh, major work and, and updates, but I, you know, I, you never know. I mean, it's, it's just, um, I, I, I see the weekends as family time for a hundred percent. So, uh, this, there's always a possibility, but Anyways, I mean, this has been my first broadcast. Uh, I'm hoping you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you guys got any questions or comments, you know what you do is you tweet me out at, at Peter Elvich. I will get to your stuff as soon as this live stream is over with. Um, have a wonderful day. Remember, the perseverance is your key to the impossible, and I will see you guys in future Periscopes. Sorry guys, I can't quite figure out how to uh how to end the broadcast. <laughs>